Okay, this is gonna be either good news or bad news, but love it or hate it, there is no denying that cardio is fantastic for our health. So today's main exercise, we're gonna be looking at cardiovascular, but first we're gonna do a mobility exercise for the spine. So standing with your feet shoulder distance in parallel, arms lengthen down by your side, feel that lovely length through the crown of the head. So we're gonna try and focus on keeping the pelvis nice and square as we do this. You're gonna slide one finger down the seams of your trousers as you initiate that move with the crown of the head. Return back up to that center point and change in sides. So everything from the waist downwards is remaining nice and still. We've got that equal weight running through both feet. And just visualize that you stand between two planks of glass. So the only way we can go is sideways. Always return back to that center point. We're aiming to do about five on each side. And relax. So today's exercise is cardiovascular and the exercises are going to be high knees and leg curl. So what we need to do is find ourselves a space, feet hip width apart. When we do this exercise, we're going to raise our knees up just below hip height one at a time, transferring body weight as we go. So as we do this, with it being a cardiovascular exercise, we want to try and build a rhythm. If you find that just doing this is quite easy, you might want to add your upper body in as well, and you might want to push and pull as you go. So we can push to the front and pull back. When we're doing cardiovascular exercise, try and do each exercise for 30 to 60 seconds and then repeat them to up to about 10 minutes. Our next exercise is leg curl. So this time all we're going to do is feet shoulder width apart, standing up nice and tall. We're going to curl our leg up to kick our bum as we go. So our heel is kicking our bum with nice rhythm. Again, you find the tempo that's right for you and the right tempo should get you slightly out of breath. If we're not increasing that heart rate, then we'll not be getting the benefits of doing this exercise. We're now going to do a stretch for our side. So standing with your feet shoulder distance in parallel and lengthening up through the crown of the head. So we're going to float one arm out towards the side, up towards the ceiling, palm facing inwards, and let's just reach the body over to one side hold in that position for about 10 to 15 seconds. So you should try to keep the pelvis nice and square, feel that length through the crown of the head. And then let's return back to that center, float the arm down, and we're gonna change sides, float that arm up towards the ceiling, palm facing inwards, reaching over, initiating that move from the crown of the head. Again, feeling that lovely stretch down the side of the body, eye line forwards and then return yourself back to that center point and floating the arm back down. Cardiovascular disease is one of the biggest killers in the UK. So it's really important that you do keep your heart healthy by doing these daily exercises. And if you enjoy those exercises, you can visit Gateshead Older People's Assembly online, or you can give them a call and let them know what you think about these exercises and if they've been helpful for you.